What's up, everybody? We are on our way to Margate, Florida to visit our pal Joey at Way Back When. Check us out. One of the first things you notice is this big robot at the entrance. Wow. And then, um, other thing I noticed was this Frankenstein signature. Holy crap. If you're into horror and, you know, collectibles, pop culture, and way back when has everything. Like, their horror collection is amazing. Like I couldn't just stop staring at all the masks and all the props that Joey has there in the store. Also, there's like rows of stuff, you know, from uh, Transformers, G.I. Joe's, Star Wars Vintage. And, you know, this is just a little bit of what he has. And if you don't see it on the shelf, just ask him. And I'm pretty sure in the back he has it because he has a room in the back full of stuff. Man, Joey has like probably one of the best uh, toy stores that I've been to for, you know, vintage toys like this. And it's like right, you know, in everybody's backyard here in Florida, man. So go check it out. Yeah, this display is just amazing. You know, I was just trying to eyeball everything. There's just so much, you know, if if you're looking for something vintage, uh, like I said, Joey probably has it in there. Uh, just like, look at those gammies. Haha, ha, word of the night. So yeah, going into the back room, he has DVDs, records, uh, laser disc, uh, video games, if I haven't said that. There's just so much, you know, Funko Pops. Um, and then this is a badass latex. And here is some Star Wars stuff, you know, for the guys that follow us, uh, just for the Star Wars. His, he has a, a good mixture of like figures and little min miniature props and, you know, toys and collectibles from the restaurants. Like these are just amazing to see in person. You know, I've seen these like on, on the internet, never got a chance to see them in person because, you know, I, I lived overseas for a few years when these were coming out. There's just so much here, you know, like these Hot Wheels, like I've only heard of these from the Spice Runners uh, show and seeing them in person, I was like, oh crap, these things are actually pretty cool. Like I missed out on a lot of this stuff because, you know, I'm not really into like the small stuff, but it's it's cool to have on a desk. And also this display with this Wookiee head and this Pepsi R2D2 cooler, amazing dude, amazing, hands down. And here's some Gentle Giant, his little Moss Eisley Cantina like bookends. That thing is freaking awesome. I should have bought it. I was thinking about that on the drive back. I was like, what the hell? I should have just picked it up. And then he has these miniatures here. These are amazing. They look so good. So if you're interested in that stuff, uh, they're on the shelf there. He still has them in stock. These are pretty cool scenes. Just continuing the, the tour, you know, there's just a bunch of random Star Wars stuff everywhere. Um, if, if you're looking for like, you know, the Pez dispenser, stuff from the Disney parks, uh, just stuff that were stored in stores, he has it, you know, this, there's a lot of cool stuff in here. Like, uh, check out the shelf, you know, with some of these vintage glasses, uh, you know, got, got, uh, some of the stuff from Galaxy's Edge up there. This is amazing, you know, just the cups alone, I was just intrigued. I don't know how long I stared at them. There's some old school Kurubikiyas, you know, those are cool, they pose good. And then he has some hot toys. So there you go. And then he has a old sideshow uh, Kenobi. And then some more cups. And these cups are freaking awesome. You know, they're hard to find. One thing about the community, you meet some great people. You know, Joey, this, this dude has a heart of gold. Uh, he's done some pretty cool things for my for my channel. And uh, we're also, uh, we're lucky enough to hang out with Shane Wessel. He's he's a fan of the Spice Runners uh, Lounge, and he's in our Facebook group. Shane, it was awesome to meet you, man. Uh, good talking to you, too, man, and thanks for your support on the channel. So now it's time to go back home. Peace.